I was pretty sore today, to be honest. I didn't really want to admit it to myself when I woke up this morning, but I saw the replay of the crash and I obviously experienced the crash myself and uh, yeah, I'm uh, quite sore and uh, just didn't quite have it today. Uh, the conditions ended up not being as dramatic as what it seemed this morning, so uh, at least that was one plus, I suppose. Um, Maybe, yes, we did have uh, dry roads, but I think the tarmac of the descent off the climb that we started was maybe a little bit on the limit of what should be acceptable in a Grand Tour. But everyone got down there safely and we uh, can continue going forward. You know, we spoke about that. I thought it was on the other side of the limit. I thought that was, uh, that should not be in a Grand Tour. M maybe you're correct, but uh, I I'll say that it was maybe on the limit. <laughs> But you still got a big smile, Jack, so... Uh, well, know. I've had uh, bad luck the last two Grand Tours in the Tour de France, and I feel as though I'm a bit cursed at the moment, which is uh, a bit annoying, because all the times I kind of feel as though it wasn't really my fault or my mistake, and it was kind of just a bit of bad luck, and I'm still here at the Giro. I'm more or less healthy and okay, just a bit, a bit sore and bruised and sad, but it's okay. We go on, there's still plenty more of the Giro to go. Some stage hunting maybe, mate. Well, try and get some recovery first and then uh, I'm not sure where Damiano is on GC but also try and help him and then yeah there's plenty more opportunities in the final week and just have my fingers crossed for a bit more sunshine. Thanks.